Well, I'm uploading a video on the career of Joe Malosh. While I'm doing that, there's a trade? Uh, yeah. It's weird because it's so weird. Um, I guess because Mark my thoughts out for the rest of the year. Um, Jamie Alexiak's the Detro Dallas Star again. You know, the funny thing is, I've kind of panned the stars for the fact that they traded Alexiak to Pittsburgh. He did very well in Pittsburgh at the beginning, and I, I wished him well, and, and he seemed to be a part of, of Pittsburgh's future on the blue line, too. How did he get... How did this... How... I guess it's a numbers game for Pittsburgh, too. Uh, Fourth-round draft pick this year is all it took to get Jamie Alexiak back into a Dallas Stars jersey. Well, okie dokie. That's uh, interesting. I Yeah, I don't really have a whole lot to add to that. You know, he's 26, appeared in 36 games this year, registering 11 points and a plus-5 rating. His 97 hits for third on the team. Lord knows we need those hits in Dallas right now. Um, and the 11 points are better on the blue line than some of the guys we've had in there. I have to say that, that Dallas's depth on the blue line has been tested all year. It's, it's been abysmal, uh, the amount of injuries that they've had and what they've had to do. But guys like Bayreuther... Um, stand out. Uh, Taylor Fadoon. I've never seen Fadoon come in and not do a decent job as a bottom two guy. Um, and the scoring upside is, has always been there with Fadoon as well. Uh, so yeah, um, he's got 47 points in 223 regular season games. Uh, he appeared in 140 games in Dallas before he got traded to Pittsburgh. And right after that, I felt like Dallas had maybe mismanaged him a bit. It's just weird because it felt like in Dallas his his progression had stopped. And then when he got to Dallas, he took that next step. And now he's back in Dallas. So, you know, let's hope it works for him. It's a new coach, so that's a good thing. He didn't seem to get on with the coaching staff that was there at the time when he left. So now that it's a new coach, things could be different. Uh, I, I think this is a deal that, that Dallas wins. I understand Pittsburgh's, you know, making room. This is one of those deals that, that we're going to look at coming up to the deadline. And either it's a sign that, that I know Justin Schultz had been skating. So this may very well mean, let me double check something. Okay. So looking for an update on Justin Schultz, um, today TSN reported him as being week to week. Um, where head coach Mike Sullivan said they're both making progress. Both of them are probably more week to week than day to day, but they're making progress. We don't have any specific points or specific specific dates with this point in mind. So they're encouraged that they're going to be back soon, but this deal gets made regardless. So uh, Jamie Alexiak is he's a big guy. He's he you know being six foot seven. There's that hey this guy could really help us on the blue line, and I guess played his way out of favor in Dallas. Or in, in, in Pittsburgh, after playing his way out of favor in Dallas before that, now he's back in Dallas. So let's see if, if this goes well for him or what happens. Let me know what you guys think. If you're a Dallas fan, how do you feel about Alexiak being back? If you're a Penguins fan, how do you feel about the team giving him up? I know there's been some complaining about Jack Johnson, and, you know, Jack Johnson's still in Pittsburgh, and, and you know, uh, Alexiak's a, 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 a decent pickup, I think, for Dallas. It's just weird. It's weird to me because it felt like when Alexiak left the team that that door was probably closed, and now it's back open. Played a grand total of 83 games in Pittsburgh, and now he's back as a member of the Dallas Stars. What's old is new again in Dallas. So let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. As always, don't forget to hit like and subscribe. If you're browsing your way through, you just happened upon this video. And hey, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll talk to you again soon.